Hi, welcome to FLDRAW Tutorials. I'm Ritesh. In this tutorial, we will be looking at FLDRAW menu bar. I have FLDRAW application open on my screen and I also have one object on the canvas. At the very top of FLDRAW, there is a menu bar. Now, menu bar offers various options file, view, edit, insert, and help. File. File has five or six more options. Uh, it lets you create a new flow, open an existing flow, close the flow that's currently open, save the flow, or pretty much send your flow to either a print preview, PDF, or JSON. View option. View has zoom in and zoom out, size, position, grid size, grid, snap to grid, and toolbars. By checking and unchecking, you can hide or unhide the toolbars. So by hiding the toolbars, it gives you more canvas space. You can also individually hide the toolbars. Grid. By clicking on the checkbox here, you can either turn the grid on or turn it off. Grid size. As a default, it's 10 pixels. I can make it 20, click set, and as you can see, the grid in the background is now 20 pixels. Edit. Let me drop a shape on the canvas. I'll move the shape around. I'll go to edit, click on undo, and you can see the shape is gone. I can do the same with redo, and the shape will appear, and it will move the shape. Duplicate. Click on an object, click duplicate, and it will create a clone of the object. Select all. We'll select all the objects on the canvas. Clear flow. We'll remove it. Preferences. We'll open the preferences window. Of course, you can do that by clicking on the gear on the top right corner. Insert. Insert has two options, label and text. Let's, let's look at each one of them. Label. Label is a single line label. Click Add. As you can see, it created a label for me. You can double click on it and change the text. Now let's click the label again create another label. There is an editable checkbox. I want this label to be a read-only label. So I uncheck that, click Add, and now by double-clicking it, I cannot modify the label. Let's look at the text object. This allows you to create a multi-line label. Click Add and you can see you can resize the label and it will turn into single line or multi-line. Help. It has two options. Contact us. Some information about FLDRAW. And about FLDRAW. Shows you the version of FLDRAW and who made FLDRAW possible. With that, I conclude this tutorial. Thank you for watching.